Hello everyone and welcome back to this channel. I'm going to be messing around with the Pastels by Beauty Bay palette. Um, I got this at Christmas and I still haven't um, used it yet but it's so stunning. Like look at all those colours. I actually don't have a plan this time around and I still don't have concealer so <laughs> that's fun. Um, so yeah, um, we're just going to take this off and mess around with this. Oh gosh, I forgot to get one thing out of here, which was the eye shadow primer. I actually made an effort and waved my hair, although the bit that's like in the bobble is kind of become less wavy. So, but I mean, I think it kind of has a nice effect, um, which is good. I don't know why, but my throat always gets like really dry, and like you can, I can just feel like everything getting like stuck at the back of it, and it's just not a fun time at all but yes how cute are these earrings not with this like eye primer but they're so cute um i actually got them from a girl that i went to college with she started her own business um it's called carrie's hall and i will link it down in the description she actually released her new drop today which is friday i'm hoping to get this video out today but if i don't it should she should still have some fabulous products like her earrings are so good there's so many on our shop right now that i'm like i just want them all like, i want these and like these i'm sorry if i look a little bit red in the cheeks like for some reason when i was drying my hair my, my um face just decided to go red so i've never used pastel shades before so i mean i probably could use a combination of all colors really couldn't i Oh, and I'm also trying out, I won this Tropic um, Lip Glaze. I'm not quite sure where it says the shade name. In Rose Blossom, which is this nice, it's a really nice colour. Um, if I can actually get it out. So I'll be trying that out too. So two products in one video. I'm also going to be ordering this, I can't remember the name of it, but it's this new... Um, foundation which is quite a light coverage so then I was thinking that I could try it out and if I like it I can use it on the channel for videos because it wasn't too bad okay where is okay here we go hmm I feel like I'm gonna go in with either euphoria or daydream like in here I'm gonna like pat them all out okay you know what I'm gonna go in with euphoria which is this really kind of pinky purpley color I'm gonna go in the crease with this. Oh my god, it's so cute. I'm very pastel -y. You can, can't really see it, it's very faint. I'll go in a wee bit more. You definitely need to go in a few times. I did um, prime my eyes, um, but I didn't have like a base shade because <laughs> that's all these. So just go in quite a bit. I really love this colour. Oh my god, it's so pretty. It's so nice. I also forgot to say in the last video that I've done that I actually applied to college to do my BA, which is exciting. Um, I'm looking forward to audition in for that if I get an audition that is. So now I'm going in with this shade Lovesick which is the pink shade. I'm just going to go in here. Oh my gosh that is such a nice combination. I don't know why I said it like that but I did. I'm actually going to go in a wee bit harder on this side. Like look how nice that is combining it that together. Oh that's so pretty. Okay, I'm going to go in with Daydream, which is this really pretty lilac colour. And I'm going to just go in here, just like along here. Ah, I think I got some of the powder in my eyeball. So just put it in there. Oh, I really like this combination. And I feel like I kind of want to go in with the, the shade either cut cloud free or serenity 
kind of like the blue or the green shade. Okay, I'm going to go in for cloud free. This may not work out, but... Oh, I like that. See what I'm doing here. I'm kind of putting the blue here. I think I need to go in a wee bit more just so that the blue pops out from that and bring it out a little bit more so then I can like I think you can see it better now I don't know like I don't know if I want to go in with the green at the end or just like go in with some more purple over the blue I don't know if I want to put like the green or if I think that that's maybe more the colour system that we're going for because I'm actually living for that. I kind of feel like a bit of a hippie with this hair and like this kind of eye colour system. I don't know if that makes no sense at all. Um, I don't know. I might go in with some more pink at the bottom. to kind of give it that kind of like illusion I don't know if that's the right word so you know you have the pink at the start and a little bit at the bottom kind of blending it in together like I actually quite like it and with these earrings as well it looks really cute where's the fluffy brush just make sure that we've blended this in Oh my god, no, I'm living for this. This palette is so cute. Like, I'm actually in love with this. So now I'm just going to moisturise, because before I moisturised too early. And then my foundation. But th that foundation... Oh my god, this is a new moisturiser. So, like, there we go. It wasn't coming out. Um. Oh my gosh, the weather is, like, insane. Oh, I love the scented one of this. It smells so good. The unscented one has got a really weird smell because it's not got a smell, if that makes sense. Like, it ha even though it's unscented, like, it still technically has a smell in a way for me. And I'm like, no, get us some nice scentedness. Like, I ordered my new ABC kit from Tropic on Monday night and I got it on Tuesday. Like, not Tuesday, Wednesday. So I was like, shook. The definitely have been speeding things up which is fabulous so oh my god I, I always forget to moisturize my nose sometimes and that's not ideal especially with the piercing but honestly I'm actually really living for this look I was gonna go walk and it's done like really dull out of nowhere and we got stuck in the rain last night which wasn't ideal me and my dad went for a walk um so we go and walk by myself during the day like just sticking to like the housing area because it's creepy otherwise <laughs> um so yeah, um, we got completely drenched last night. So I was like, I need to, you know, go with my dad again because it's better company for sure. Oh no, I didn't really think about having earrings on and trying to do this. Hopefully we don't get any foundation on them. <laughs> that would be so sad. But the lady has the house and forms. I think she's gonna phone at some point today and I'm actually just doing this makeup to just record some more videos after this one and um do nothing so you know that's fun <laughs> I mean pretty not got much else to do nowadays I'm so happy to be getting into doing more makeup videos because I do find them fun to do and then you guys said you wanted to see more so I was like I can make that happen I wonder if it would look cute if I put like some purple under my eye we'll do that in just one second just make sure You've got it all blended out. 
Honestly, who else has been watching Drag Race UK? I'm not gonna give spoilers away, but oh my god, last night was so good. So, so good. Loving it. Stopped watching Drag Race for a while though because of the whole, um, the wait, well, the first reason was from, because I never watched Drag Race. I went with my friend to go see a drag show and I fell in love with Bianca Del Rio and Willem. I was like, oh my God, Willem is like amazing. He's like my favorite. Um, and then my friend was like, you know, you should check out the drag, like the show that they came from. And I was like, okay. Um, oh my God, this powder has gone everywhere. Um, I was like, oh my God, okay. So like I started watching it. I couldn't really watch season one or two just because of the quality. I was like, mm, no, thank you. Um, and then I kind of skipped a few and watched season three. Um, season three, four, some of five and six. But like after I'd done that, um, I kind of just stopped watching it because of the way Willem was getting, like the way that like they treated Willem because I have three copies of Willem's book and you know, like, I don't think he really talks about his book, but I know that he's spoken openly about the way that he was treated and all the other queens were treated. Um, on Drag Race like they wouldn't remember their names and all that sort of stuff so I was like no and the way Fifi O'Hara I know that it doesn't go by Fifi O'Hara anymore but the way that Fifi was like treating Willem I was like no thank you like I'm not with, I'm not with that um and then the whole RuPaul thing where he was being like transphobic I was like no absolutely not so I kind of was like I'm not watching it because of that like no um but then the UK one came and I was like, I'm only going to watch it to support the Queens, not to support RuPaul. Because um, he's a bit, pro no, not a bit, he's quite problematic. So yeah, I was watching it for the Queens and oh my gosh, I love the UK one. Like I literally cannot get into the American one now though, which is such a shame because it was good, but it's just not my cup of tea anymore. <laughs> like tea or coffee. Oh, I love tea or coffee. She's so good. But yes, my favourite on Drag Race. Oh yeah, I was maybe going to put some under my eye. Yeah, so let's do that actually. Before I put all these brushes away. Actually, the brush I need's here, so it's fine. Um, but yeah, my favourite um, like I like a lot, like I like, I do enjoy a lot of them on this season, like the UK season two has been like so good. Um, There has been a couple, oh that's cute, oh my god, I did purple and then I did pink there to kind of like join it up. I never done it on this side though, so I'm going to do that now. So, like that, if you can see it, so like it joins up. I'm so proud of that. Yes, because a couple of times my makeup on the channel has gone like so bad. But I'm, it's getting there. I'm like so happy that it's getting there because yikes. Honestly, people, if you've seen my like other videos, you'll have seen the times where they have gone so bad and you're just like, yikes. Oh, that time when my sister made me do pick my makeup and um she made me look awful and then I'm having a meltdown about red lipstick. If you're interested in that video, I will link it somewhere up here and you can check it out because yikes, it was um, an interesting video for sure. Um, but yeah, my favourites, like if I had to have like top favourites, I mean, tea or coffee, although, spoiler, she's no longer in the season if you've not watched, but um, My like ultimate favourite is Ellie Diamond, Dundee Queen. Woo! Um, plus I knew of her before she went into Drag Race. So I was like so buzzing when I saw that she was going in. I was like, oh my God, yes. I do love Lawrence Cheney as well. Um, but the other, like the, the last, the top five are like really good. Because I do like a horror. Like I didn't. I was not a fan of Ahora for a while, but she definitely grew on me. 
which is good. And then there's Bimini, Bamboo Lash, and there's Tay. So like they're all like really good as well. But definitely voting for rooting even for my um Scottish queens. But yeah, sorry, I just like went on a bit of a rant. Not like a rant, but like off topic about drag race. But yeah. I always wanted oh I saw the Beauty Bay do like they have like pastel high um eyeliners which would have been so cute for this look but I really need to practice my eyeliner skills again just because they are terrible. Like literally when I haven't done it in a while, like it would literally ruin the look and I'm not even kidding. It's not even funny. Woohoo! So yes, I still need to- oh no. Oh shit, I've done it again. I forgot to set it with the spray and I just put my mascara on. I'm just gonna like do it in sections I guess. I suppose you can't really do that can you? <laughs> just keep my eyes open for like a good while. <laughs> Why do I do this to myself? every time apart from last time i managed to not do that but this one time i completely forgot and just ruined it it's okay i can fix that when i like finish before i record other videos Ooh, so this is what the tropic lip lacquer looks like lip glaze not lip lacquer oh my god it smells interesting like what is it Ooh. Like, I'm not sure what a lip glaze is, but I'm here for it. Ooh, I'm not sure if it contrasts, I really do feel like a happy now. I'm not sure if it contrasts too much. <laughs> with the eyeshadow but it's so cute oh i like the shade it's so cute but yes please excuse the mascara that's under my eye <laughs> um but yes this is the finished look um probably the quickest makeup video that i've like done in a while um super happy how this turned out and i hope you guys enjoyed this video as i said i will put the link to Carrie's haul shop, her Etsy shop in the description if you want to have a look at her other eatings. And I will see you guys soon. <laughs> Bye.